Yeah, he's back home now in NA, and he didn't really get what he wanted from Masters. He was hoping for the win, but I think it was third place that got. It was still pretty respectable overall. Great performance from Optic, but just weren't able to win it in the end. But yeah, if you don't know who Ye is, you know, just look at his stats. 50% headshot with the Vandal, 55 with the Sheriff, 56 with the Ghost. He's just a nutcase. He's just a god at the game. So today we're going to go over one of his Breeze games and see how he plays it and see what we can learn. So let's go. All right, so real quick before we get into it, 90% of you aren't subbed. So if you like my stuff and you want to keep watching it, please sub. And uh, yeah, let's go. All right, so we're starting on Breeze attack. Looks like he's just going to go for the Sheriff buy. I love the Sheriff buy on this map. I think it's just great overall. Just take a lot of duels. You can just body shot people down as well from such far away. Especially on a character like Jet, you can really abuse it. And the Viper Orb's up here. It'll be very, very hard to push through. Still better, it doesn't ping anyone. And see, if you push through this, it's just a death trap. His Viper just b-hops in, gets punished for it. He just dashes straight in here, see what he can get. Nothing. Kind of terrible overall from this entire team, I'm not gonna lie. Like, um... You get a Viper Orb like this, you don't really want to push it, like, especially on a pistol round. Like, it's, it's so bad, like, you can see, they just got stomped. Even Radiant Elo, so. What happens to you? Just rotate, that's a better play here. Buys the Marshal. Okay, I always recommend, if you lose pistol round, buy the Sheriff or buy the Marshal, buy something. Buy a Shorty, even. Like, you need to buy something. Because if you don't buy anything, you're just trolling your... Trolling your round here. Light armor will be good enough for the next round. As long as you got... Yes, there you go again. As long as you got tardy tree under credits, you're good. So you can buy light armor plus a rifle. This is great crosshair placement. Yeah, the rain to kill, by the way. He gets a one tap to buy the silver. You see, because he got that kill on Reyna, it's a lot... Oh, never mind. As I say it. <laughs> It's a lot more of a winnable round though. You actually give yourself a chance when you start buying more often. You know what I mean? Like, it's not there's not that many rounds in this game, so you really wanna have as many buys as you can. He's got a light armor plus rifle and one smoke. That's plenty, plenty to buy. You don't need a full buy on most characters. Bought it here. He's playing a lot just for this tube. Fakes the drop there. Spots him. Nice. Great crosshair placement again. See how he faked the drop on the Sova, so he didn't know if he was actually dropping or not with the, the tag that was smart. This is the Viper anyway, I don't know. Crosshair placement spamming where he thought he'd be. And this one patient. Got no dash, he was just trying to play the off angle there. The less enemies alive, the better off angles get. Quick tip for you. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. This guy's a fucking demon, I swear. Don't call him Diablo for nothing, man. Just the shots, man. It's, it's, his crosshair never, ever in a wrong position, you know? He just makes it look so fucking easy. He's not one of those flicky players. Like, he's just always just the right crosshair. You see how perfect. Like, just watch the way he moves around. The way he's just pre-aiming the head at all times. He knows head height and everything. There's so many death matches he yeah, does. Just dashes straight in here. Half wall, half wall. You can take a duel on this guy when the... Can't find the Reyna yet. So he's lurking around. See, he's not trying to reveal a spot. There you go. Into a 1v1 now. Lots of in mid. ADS is a lot, yeah, he does. I didn't even realize. Starting to notice at this game. Oh, he spots him. He didn't actually see him. And he actually whiffs. I think he panicked there. Yeah, he, he panicked there because his team said he saw him. <laughs> I think he looked away or looked at the map or something well, as he seen him, but yeah. He's going for the knives here, yeah. Your jet knives, great buy. Like, he just... Oh. 
Viper gets suppressed here. Can do. There you go. How is nobody shooting this chamber, man? That's that's kind of a bad from his teammates. It's really bad from chamber as well. You seen you seen what he's going for though? Like uh, it was good. He, like he updrafts, takes the duel on the jet, and then he can dash out. But the chamber is able to just shoot him in the back there. Kind of um. Oh, is Silver gonna win this? He does win it. Wow. I want. To, I just want to skip by him, but he actually won the round. Yeah, kind of unfortunate there. Chamber ops popped here. He doesn't really want to peek. Wait, chamber was right here. He actually gets um. He would have died there, I think, if he was peeking. Yo, chamber turn. He's right in front of me, right here, bro. He's not, no, he's he not, bro. He's right it. here. <laughs> These comms are terrible, man. These comms are terrible. What? I said chamber push, bro. There's one thing I noticed about NA compared to EU. There's a lot of, Like, the comms that do come out, there's a lot of bullshit in the comms, you know what I mean? Like, there's a lot of bullshit. EU comms is usually, like, since so many people are trying to just speak English, even if they're not native speakers, like... It's so, you just don't get as much bullshit because they're not like, they're not chatting as much, you know what I mean? Yeah, you can play off. They're just trying to give you the comms because they only know like um specific uh, comm words, you know, instead of a full drop it, drop it. English language compared to NA where you just get a lot of bullshit. I don't know. I've noticed a lot in streamers games. Comms are just like, they're they're better, but they're also worse. Bit of a give and take. Oh, fuck that. What the fuck? My man had a lineup. Get them. Actually, yeah, he had a lineup for that. <laughs> Of the bounce, it's kind of weird. Needs a drop. Keep your eye on target. Only problem then, though, with EU is sometimes you just get no comms. Like, you get no comms a lot more in EU. Just gonna spam the chamber trip there, I think. Just begging someone to peek him. Doesn't get the trip. If this Reyna peaks, that's the end of his life. He's playing it so patient, you see this? He's just playing it so patient. He's not... He's not like a go, 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 uh, he gets punished. But... That is a weird position, I'm not even gonna lie. It's just chamber, doing chamber things. Very weird position, he's watching... Top mid and not elbow at all. It's very strange. He's such a he's such a like patient player though. You know what I mean? Like he's not he's not like a tens where he's like go 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 go. You know? Just consistency. That's that's what he strives for. That's why it's so hard to beat him. He just doesn't make many mistakes and he just doesn't miss headshots. Put that wall down. Wall down. There, oh, oh my god. Wait, we got double dinked by the sheriff and the stinger. His teammates are kind of baiting there. Kind of unfortunate. He wasted both of his smokes too early in the round there. If he had, uh, if he had smoke there, he could have bailed himself out. His teammates definitely should have went in though, I'm not sure. Uh, maybe they were like mollied off or something. One more T spawn. You're fine, Kate, you're fine. I think this team yeah, can win this though. This guy, like, near half wall, or, like, back yeah, I was kind of shocked when yeah, Optic didn't win to be honest. Nice kill there by KO. We're just gonna double flash him, you know. I can't see anything. No one above him. Sova wins the duel in the end, but Kao wins the round, so we're all good. I, I forgot he was minus 80. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, in um, in the... What's it called? Copenhagen, that's what it was practice. called. It just kind of comes with time and just playing the game a lot, you know? In there, like, I mean, Optic definitely did very well. But, um, I think the other teams just played it better. Like, Paper X were just 
caught up the cough so hard. Like it was a bit of a close game, but that first map just did not look close. It was a fucking, it was just a stomp to be honest. From Paper X. And FPX as well was just a great team there. Can you hold walls, somebody? Yeah, by the way, like his aim uh, I don't even know what to say about it anymore, but like it this uh, he's just he just doesn't miss. <laughs> I was watching um the first game Optic lost in the, the Masters event. I looked at Ye's EU profile and he played like 14 DMs in like the same day. <laughs> it was ridiculous. He played he played so many DMs. He's a bit of a deathmatch warrior. I don't know how he does it, man. That match tilts the fuck out of me. Too many sound whores, man. I have the spike. Shouldn't you cover my map to prevent stream snipers? Yeah, I should, but I don't know if I care that much. They have the lead. Let the stream snipers stream snipe. Let them on. Come with the knives again. I'm looking for him. On the right. He's on the right. I'm burning so much. Very aggressive on this tube. That's what I'm noticing. Just gonna dash straight in. Get the right click. Nice. A lot of people don't think right clicking is worth it with knives sometimes. I, I've heard a lot of people, especially. I shot there. Can't get it. Yeah, so many people get like. They get really mad when you right click them, like just when you pop knives, but. It's such it's such a worth trade. Like you get a. It's pretty much a raise rocket. You run and jump at them and kill them with a the raise rocket. And then you steal their gun. Like it, it's perfect. There's no reason not to. And you see how much. How often he's trying to buy, like. You're losing it. You're not even losing the game, but hey, let me get light armor is. Pl if you can get light armor vandal, that's a full buy. It doesn't matter even if if you have one smoke on jet, that's a full buy. You don't need anything else. Sure, it's nice to be able to buy it all, but you want to get as many buys as possible. Like you can't be just gifting the enemy these free rounds. This whole team's buying here. This guy's even got a guardian. Did you see me? I don't. He might have actually. We're going back to A, bro. He's gonna... Okay, I'm gonna die. Are we going B? Well, right, did I just see you? Like... I'm not sure if you saw me. I'm starting now, it's on the way. Playing it slow here. And a lot of times in lower elos, playing, like, he's just playing default right now. A lot of times in lower elos, there's no such thing as a default. Like, if you, if you go and default on jet, all of a sudden your whole team's rushing A, they're not even communicating, and then they're like, Oh my god, my jet's baiting me, what is he doing? So I would just... What is this chamber doing? That's my question. I, yeah, I would just be careful, like, playing slow like this. You have to really communicate it. There's a lot of shit going on here. Dude, what the fuck? When, when the game gets like into super chaos, that's when EA kind of falters. Like, Ye is one of, if not the best, like, in a structured game. He can just click his heads, and he knows where they're coming from. But when shit's going off, like, it's getting really chaotic. Like, it's too much to think about. You, can, you can't hit those flicks as hard as some other players. But, like, compared to, like, someone like Ten. Ooh. Sheesh. Yeah, but you know what I mean? Like, he's not... He can't go bang, 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 bang. But he will click your head if you're on his screen. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's just... It's exactly what I'm saying. Like, he just... Don't miss. I wouldn't recommend taking that duel, by the way. Like, if you if you died there and you watched back this VOD, you'd be like, yeah, you should not have... You heard him ult and you shouldn't peek it, but... Sometimes, like, better players can just get away with this. Pure, like, pure confidence play. My wall's gonna go down there. Didn't even pop the dash for it either. Like if he whip there, he's dead. Railing. Where you guys fall back? Where you guys fall? Actually. I'm dead though. On the right. On the left. He catches them all off guard. He knows the rotate time. So oh, he gets a triple now for their end. Can kill the viper? No. He literally is like the smoke you're running to. That's the thing about Breeze though. A lot of the time, like. If you don't have a guy going mid, it's so hard. You've seen, you've seen it on the pistol round when they played it. Like, 
they went 5A main and they just got stomped because of one Viper Orb. Whereas if you have a guy going mid, a guy going tube, it's the site is so much easier to hit, you know? It's a lot more open. The enemy has, they can't just focus everyone looking down. It's a lot easier. Look at the banana knife. He actually has it upgraded. Usually people don't upgrade the banana knife. Can't break the dart in time. The double headshot doesn't even pop the dash. What? Nah, nah, nah. Ah, uh, no, no, no. That's just Diablo moment, to be honest with you, bro. Like, what the fuck? Like, look at his back. Like, breaks the dart. Takes the do uh, one of you on the jet, flicks over, just hits the Reyna. Finally pops dash. Just flicks down and one tops this guy, man. What the fuck is he on? His raw mechanics are just different, man. Smokes the dart. It's always quicker to smoke the dart than to, uh... Or not quicker, well, if you have your knife out, it's quicker to smoke the dart. But, um... It's just very strong. Oh, you can find this guy. Stink through the wall. Yeah, it's usually more effective to smoke the dart, because then the enemy don't know if you pushed it or not. Like, from their point of view, they only... Yes. From their point of view, the, the dart didn't scan anything, so they feel safe, but... Actually not. See, so he goes for the, the Sheriff by here. The thing about the... Like, if you keep your Sheriff from pistol, you can op right now, which is the strong part. But he's just gonna buy a rifle. That's actually because he doesn't... He doesn't like opping in ranked, but... I'd recommend, well, now that Jet's changed, like, opping isn't as effective, but if you're good at opping, it's still a very good op agent. Like, I, I still op quite a lot on Jet. Especially on a map like Breeze or Scent can be so strong. Mainly on defense nowadays. He's smoking the dart again. I love this position, by the way. But he actually gets punished from elbow. Quite annoying that the the jet came. Yeah, he came very quick. I agree. I, I kind of wanted to do the same thing there. I do this play a lot where he just did that. You run out. You, you usually don't even doubt it, to be honest. But you just run out, jump on top of that box, pop your dash. You get one or two for free. Very consistent play. Just unlucky that the, the jet wide swings elbow here. I think they win this, right? This viper is going crazy. Yeah, they're both on safe. I don't want to see if the viper wins it. The enemy viper. Thirty seconds. I feel like it's obvious now. One enemy remaining. Nice. Spike down B. Should be a connector. They might push KO. Oh no, never mind. Dart is ready. Dart is ready. I guess he has some time. That shit. I feel like the Viper. No. Nice. I thought the Viper might actually win that one. He was kind of going crazy, but. Okay. Stop losing it. Saving dart. There's another full boy here. Really, honestly, really focus on these pistol rounds, man. They have won three rounds in a row off the back of pistol round. Like, pistol round is so important. If you can practice your pistols. You will just, your win rate will go up so hard. Like, if you can win both pistol rounds consistently, that's pretty much a free game. And he is completely trolling this, by the way. He knows the enemy's on a, a low buy, he knows it. And then he just jumps in and beats. Even, even pro players, even some of the best players in the world are just brain dead sometimes. It's just how it is. You gotta get all that inting out of your system, you know? 
go, because I have been like, that was so dope. And doing the same play here. Actually going to take mid or elbow here instead, just because the diet was very awkward. Okay. There's updrafts on the box and takes the duel. Oh, fuck, he's mid. You see, there was no real risk to doing that, though, because he has the dash proc. You know what I mean? He had the dash proc, so if he whiffed his first couple bullets there, he could have just dashed his way out. No, nah, he's pushed to B. He's already planning. Even if he weren't confident to land the headshot straight away, you could have just dashed out the second you seen the silver. Like, you can use... You can use your updraft and dash for info. This is what a lot of people don't do, like, especially, especially the updraft. This is what I do a lot, is I'll updraft just for info. Like, you can jump over a place, or you can updraft, peek something. Like, if you think someone's up in something, you can updraft and peek, and then your teammate can swing. I think I've gotten mid every single round. Do you press Z and B with your thumb? No, so I press... I guess I sometimes use my thumb for Z, but I also use this finger right here. Uh... Ring finger. I use my ring finger to sometimes press it. This is ring finger to press Z. I just really, yeah, his binds are very strange. It goes with Z and V. There's um, updraft and dash. Two very awkward. I think he has this chamber, right? Nice. I haven't used jet knives in such a long time. Stop, bud. Just stop. See the ace? Doesn't get the ace. Man. What the fuck is that? That's gotta be the cleanest jet knives I've ever seen. It's just one by one. What? He is actually so good at this game, man. Actually so impressive to watch. I, I love watching the ace. But anyway... That was the video, so thanks for watching, like, sub, hope you learned something, and uh, yeah, we'll see you later.